fantastic experience. I don't know if you know, Jimmy put me through to um, Dale Martin at um, Red Bull Media Team. And then he kind of came to my house and got interviewed just to... Because they had to select... Or they went to... It was out of 100 candidates. So they went to... They, they narrowed it down to 10. And then they went around to the 10, 10 individuals' houses and had like an interview about their background and stuff like that. And then they chose three out of the 10 and I was one of the three. They sent me an email and gave me a ring just to say that we find your story interesting and it would do well for the documentary. And and how was the the actual process? Obviously, you had the the selection yeah. game in London, didn't you? Before before they chose who was going out there. Yeah. Well, what it was, well, we, we they done a little background documentary about where I've been and what I've been doing and stuff like that. And then two days after that, there was a trial game with the three boys that they picked from London. And obviously, we played a trial game and we just had to perform. And they picked me out of the three boys. And how did you feel when he told you that you'd be the one that's going? Yeah, it was, it was a good feeling because going to train with another team abroad, never done it before, so I was looking forward to it. When I got there, it was a bit overwhelming because the facilities was, like, top level. Yeah. And then we'd done a bit of a, a light session just to ease me into it with all the, the under-23s under and done a bit of shooting, a bit of just technical work nothing too much I found it really 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 good and was there one moment in the week that stood out for you as a highlight training with the the under 23s on the Thursday was good because we done a lot of small sided games a lot of possession a lot of stuff stuff that relates to my game and that was that was my standout bit and then the individual stuff I done an individual session with one of the coaches like work on my touch, shooting, crossing. And how how did it help you game the week with obviously Champions League club and a different different game over there in Germany as well, isn't it? Yeah, it helped me realise that football's a lot different no matter where you go. It's not all the same. In Germany, they like to get the ball to feet and they like to play. They like to attack the ball aggressively. They like to keep it on the floor and just work as a team. Whereas in England, it's a bit more... They skip the midfield really, straight to straight to the forwards and back to the defence and it's a bit yeah. The Germany is a lot more tactical. A lot more tactical. And do you do you have a, a preference? What do you think suits your game more, the the German game or would you like to stick German here? And... Game suits my, it's it's tough and I, it it will be hard but I prefer the way they play in Germany. Would you like to get back out there or explore other options or it would be nice. Mm. Be nice, but for now it's more of settling and getting my head down and get playing here again. Because I was playing non-league for Royston, I had a good successful year with them. It's just about moving forward now. And obviously, you spent quite a lot of time with Cisse, and obviously, you know, he was a, a striker, won the Champions League. Did he help you again? Did he give you any advice, any tips? Yeah, he gave me a lot of advice off the field as well as on the field. I mentally prepare for games and stuff like that. And he also helped me whilst I was out there. He helped me, give me, gave me feedback. Because they gave me feedback as well, which is very good. And, um, yeah, you still in contact with the guys out there? Or is it is it over now? Or Yeah, I still speak to uh, Martin, the guy who initially came to my house and I did interview and stuff. Mm -hmm. I spoke to him about, he's, he reckoned, my best chance was possibly going to the New York Red Bulls. He, he reckons that I would have suited there. So what he's done was he sent a few emails around and he's just waiting for them to get back. So how, how heavily were UK football trials involved with kind of setting the whole opportunity up for you? Without Jimmy, obviously, I wouldn't have got the contact to them in the first place. So the UK football trials have obviously seen something in me to forward me to that. And you've been to five, six of our of our trials before, so obviously you've been with us for a couple of years now, haven't you? I believe UK football trial does work. It does work because I have been to like the likes of Barnsley, Accrington, stuff like that for a UK football trial, so it has worked. Finally, I think the is there any one thing you'd yeah you, that you took away from the experience from the week? Um, I took a lot away from there. But the main thing I took from there was knowing my ability fully. 
I understand that I've got a lot more to give, which I didn't know that before until, until I went out there. Yeah, brilliant. Cheers, guys. Take care. Talk to you soon.